What's up guys, Lexi-C back at it again with another video. Today we will be checking out some clothing hacks. I don't know if these work, I don't know how good they are, but we'll see, so let's just hop right into it. If this is how you normally fold your jeans, try this instead. Pinch and fold over Ooh, the side. Ooh, this hack is for guys and girls because the capris is definitely a look for guys. I like that, and I'm into that. It's simple but makes such a big difference. This is good if you're short too. On your clothes, here's a simple hack to get rid of them. Take a razor, any kind. Okay, this is gonna be a really good hack if you're anything like me and buy all your clothes at cheap stores like Fashion Nova and Forever 21. This will literally happen to your clothes. It's actually meant for your face, it's so fast. I use it for this. Scrape those. That is genius. Off, and you're good to go. Life changing right there. She she has fabric scissors. She she's not messing around. But you can use any scissors to do this. I love cutting my t-shirts. I cut a lot of my own t-shirts. She's bringing this shirt from basic to like a whole Coachella vibe. She's ready for Coachella. You could just use a shoestring for this, but. I, I thought she already did the hack, I'm like, patiently awaiting oh that's genius i wonder if this looks good though you can tell it's a little botched a little botched in the crotch but if you're desperate i always wear high-waisted with a crop so for me that might not work because you would see it if you have a crop top on she's doing so many folds Oh, that actually looks good. We're pinning our shoelaces. I don't know if that's necessary. I don't think it's necessary. Okay, most of these are see-through, so beware. If you're wearing this, make sure you're not showing too much. Because these scarves are most of the time see-through. Again, the Capri look is in for girls and guys. So, we saw this one. Do you have an oversized button-down laying around? Or did you just borrow one from your dad like I did? Let me show you how you can transform this into a super chic and stylish dress. Go ahead, throw it on, and button it all the way up. Oh, the top two I thought we were just going to add a bell. It, it backwards. Grab the two arm sleeves, throw them in the back, and tie them into a tight double knot. Turn back around, pull and adjust as needed. Say hello to your new super fabulous What do you guys think of this? Do you think, you, do you think anyone would notice if you actually did this? This is a good idea. I'm liking this. But you do have to wear a bra for those of you who don't like doing so. Why do I feel like that's not going to stay like that at all? Oh, two ties. I personally think that the knot in the front is in style, so I just like to take a hoodie, tie it in the front, but you can do whatever, you know, whatever floats your boat. That you're unsure what to do with? Let me show you how to revamp them into a cool new top. Grab a pair of scissors and cut your I actually have a lot of leggings that I don't wear, so I might have to try this one out. Take the two pant legs and tie in a double knot in the back of your head. Turn around and reveal your new super chic halter top. It's Are a cute to shirt. It looks like every shirt that I wear. I need these hacks because I am so Try ratchet that I just tie a shoelace around my waist for a belt. I could be doing way better. This looks way too complicated. Once it's all zipped up, grab some clear nail polish, coat the end of the zipper so you won't have any more trouble. And there you have it. You've just saved your zipper and now you can go back to looking fabulous. Okay, the zipper thing, if you guys think that you don't need this hack and you're just straight up ignoring it, and then you're out one day and you sit down in the zipper on your pants rips, you're gonna wish that you paid better attention to this video. So just remember it for future references. Could save your life. Ha! 
I feel like nowadays pins are in you can put pins on the outside you don't even have to hide them anymore put like five in a row and it's a whole grungy cute look oh i'm short i need these take the end of your pant leg and thread it through the inside of your pant all the way up to the top waistband secure it to the inner waistband with the safety pin go ahead and repeat it on the other side pull and adjust as needed now you're looking super fresh and a brand new pair of shorts never let a pair of pants they look a little bulgy Make a loop on each side, feed the tails to the opposite loop. Now you can pull the strings to tighten or pull apart the nuts to loosen. Pray for the little ones as well. Or you like can just tie it in a bow. Tips. That was too much effort. I can barely tie a bow, let alone that. So they're getting really advanced with these hacks, you guys. I'm gonna have to start paying better attention. That's cute. Mm, I don't like that. See, you know, I'm not loving the layered looks. They're cute sometimes, but so I'm sure all not my style. Tiny muscle tees that everyone's wearing right now. So here's a quick hack to turn your basic tee into a muscle tee. Let me show you how it's done. Start with the basic t-shirt and pull down the straps of whatever you're wearing underneath. Then tuck the sleeve of your shirt under the strap and pull it back on your shoulder. Adjust the fabric as needed and smooth it out to create your new sleeve. Go ahead and repeat on the other side. And Easy. say hello to your new fabulous muzzle tee that didn't cost you a thing. Oh, I thought it was going to be a little more difficult than that. I thought we were going to cut it. I thought we were going to do something, but that's okay. I'm making a knot. Then you're going to tuck in one strap, including the knot, and closing it, making sure one strap is out. Oh, that's a good one. That can make, like, one purse into three different looks. Okay, here's another good hack for if you are wearing your dad's t-shirts. If you've really ran out of outfits, I know we've all been there. So this looks like it's going to work for that. And you're not going to cut it and destroy it, so you're doing good. Here are five different ways to wear your multi-way bra. Number one, wear it as a regular bra. Make sure straps are hooked front and back. Number two, wear it as a razorback. Front straps will stay the same, oh. but you'll cross the back straps so that it looks something like this. Smart. Number three, the one shoulder. You won't even Take see it. Take off one of the straps. How does this work? Front and back, and now you have a one shoulder strapless bra. No one will ever know. Number four, perfect for asymmetrical tops. No one will tops. ever know. Hook the front to the opposite side of the back, and you'll get this diagonal. Why do I feel like you might get a little a bit lopsided if you do this? Take I don't know. Strap, I would have to see for myself. Around the neck to but the side, and tuck the straps you might look a little like for more. unsymmetrical. Just a fair warning for you guys if you're going to try this. Oh, I've been wanting to do this. This looks really good with if you do it to black like she did on the right. I love that. I literally just spent so much money on Melrose buying something that I probably could have made for way cheaper. Okay, so we're basically cutting two shirts in half. I think we might, oh, I was just about to say, I think we might have to learn how to sew for this. The shirt looks cute. I love the v-neck. That made it different than other ones I've seen in the past. Ooh. How is she gonna hide? No. And this is another way that, it, okay, so yes, we have sports bras and we have like padded bras and obviously sports bras are more comfortable. This, you don't even have to wear a real bra. This girl is really smart. She's really smart. She's proving herself. She's like, my hack works. Don't tell me that my hack doesn't work. She knows her hack works. All right guys, well that is all the clothing hacks I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed them. Be sure to like this video, leave a comment of your favorite hack, and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you again tomorrow with another video.